mean, every year it's tough, but uh, this year in particular with four top ten teams, it uh, is shaping up to be a, a great, great tournament. Uh, I think both Wisconsin and, and us know that we're going to be playing next weekend, and uh, but North Dakota and Bemidji are fighting for their lives, so uh, it's going to be uh, some real intense games up there. We have a chance to win a championship, so I think any time, I mean, that's one of our three goals is to win the WCHA tournament championship, so I think it's a big deal to win that and I think that keeps us motivated. Yeah, I think their record doesn't always show what kind of team they are. They're very feisty and they just play really hard and I think um, that's kind of been our problem is just um, they just they never stop working and you can't when you play a team like that it's hard but um, hopefully we can do what we did up in Bemidji a couple weeks ago and get another win. You can get um, five girls on the ice that are going to bust their butts and be grinders on every single line. It makes it really hard to play against the style of play, the double chase, um, and being right on top of you. And uh, They're very dedicated, block a lot of shots. It's always a, a really good game every time we play them. This weekend will be a big test for us, but I think if we can go up there and do well, I think that will be good leading into the NCAA tournament. Yeah, very well deserved. I, I think she was last year as well. I think she was voted uh, preseason player of the year. And, you know, there's a lot of pressure on on, uh, on Hannah each and every year, but her game has continued to develop and progress. And um, uh, I think she was a slam dunk for it this year. Uh, she's so humble. She's gracious. Uh, she's team first. You would, in talking with her, never know that she's a, a real good hockey player. Uh, she's almost aloof and maybe uh, doesn't even understand how good she is sometimes, but uh, she's that type of kid.